Yes. Hello everybody and thank you for watching. So last week I took an underwater camera deep sea fishing in Miami. We were at depths between 150 and 200 feet of water and the results are pretty shocking. really eye-opening to finally unveil the bottom and see what's down there in these spots that we fish every weekend. Perfect. So, this part was really unexpected. Look at those numbers. There are so many Almaco jacks. I mean, I have fished this spot many times and we catch one or two, but I never expected there to be this many surrounding the pig. Although I'm not hooking them, and clearly a high speed or slow pitch jig would have been a much better option, we're using the Lucanus jig because it requires very little motion, and that allows the camera to sit still and better capture the footage. Here, we see a school of sand tilefish in its natural environment on the bottom of the sea floor, and there are some mixed in porgies as well. Ever wonder what snagged your line? Here we can see that as I move around the sponge, I snag on the smallest piece of something in the bottom of the ocean. Thank God that the line to the jig and not to my camera. I almost had a heart attack. This is what I caught the right in the picture. Oh. Yep. Bottom. Or not. Yeah, it is. No. Bottom, and you know what's on there. Oh, oh God. Oh. Oh, God. oh, yes. 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 <laughs> <laughs> all right so for the moment you've all been waiting for yes i did manage to catch two fish while using the jig here's some footage of the porgies actually hitting the jig so the second strike was shot see how i'm dragging along a piece of sea fan from the bottom 
normally you think a fish would never actually hit that, but as we can see, it quickly hits the jig. Now, I'm not sure why, perhaps one of you can actually tell me in the comment section below, but as I'm bringing the fish up, it got very white and pale. Now, I think this might have to do with the shaking of the camera or the white balancing not being quick enough as we move up into brighter light. I got everything on. The bite, the fight. had to make his appearance. He actually circled the jig for the next couple minutes. Watch this, the remora goes right for the jig and last minute decides not to hit it. Wasn't that awesome? That's one of my favorite scenes. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell to be notified when new videos come out. Like always, keep jigging.